Hello everyone, welcome to SAP Technomaniac. In this video, we will see union and having close in ABAP. So, first we will discuss having. As you can see in my one of the previous video where I have explained group by, there I have, have already explained the select query. In this select query, what we are doing, we are getting the data from the sales order table and customer table. We are making inner join and for each customer, what all are the sales orders are there? I mean, how many number of sales order and what is the total net we are means net amount for those sales order. What is the maximum amount, minimum amount or average amount for that particular customer we are displaying in the output using the group by close. This I have already explained in my one of the previous video. If you don't know, link is there. You can go and watch it out. Let me display the result how it is displaying first. Let me do F9 for this. So as soon as you see group F9, let me open it parallelly. So in this output, you can see we have the customer ID, we have customer, we have the currency and total net price for particular customer and how many sales order for that particular customer? 15 number of sales order. And what was the total amount for that particular sales order? So sales order 1600. What is the uh, average amount, maximum amount and minimum amount? Each and everything we are displaying. As I showed you in my last video and I showed you for this particular sex, uh, uh, particular customer how it is becoming, becoming 600 in VB uh, from the VBAK table. So in this video, suppose the requirement is like that. I don't want to display these all the detail. I want to display the only customers which is having the amount total net amount is greater than 10,000 those only customer I want to display in output because those are the important for me I don't want to display all the sales order all the customers in the output so for that what I can do so if I want to put where conditions suppose I, I want to achieve this with the where conditions okay so how what will happen where condition I can't put on this amount if I try to put because Ultimately, I have to put the total on the net price after the aggregation. What is uh, aggregation amount? It is I have to check it is greater than 10,000 or not. Suppose I try to put like this. If it is control V, one second, I have to put control Z, control C, control V is greater than 10,000. Can I put like this where condition? Let me check what the error. The database function sum cannot be called in where close. We will get like that. Then how we can achieve? SAP is given one more thing. Whenever we use the group by close, after the grouping all the data, we got particular result. Now we want to filter out that result further. We want, suppose we got 10,000 entry. Based on 10 condition after group, grouping, we got the 10,000 entry. And now I want what I want to do based on the some condition. I want to filter out out of 10,000 that can be 5,000 or 500 only. I want to display in the output. I want to put some condition. I want to filter that one and those entries. I want only I want to get and display in the output. So for that purpose, once the we group the result after grouping, we want to further filter out some data. For that purpose, we will use the having close. So having close, what I have to do? I have to do having. Now I can use this aggregate function. Control C, Control V. This should be greater than 10,000. Or you can put greater than equal to based on your requirement. Let me activate my function uh, code. So you can, how many entries currently it is there? It's a, you can see too many entries are there. Let, let me clear out the console. Let me do control F3. Activate my code. Let me do F9. Now you can see I'm getting only those customers which is having the net price amount Yeah, net amount is greater than 10,000. Other customer I'm not getting at all. So like that we can use having close. 
there is a few things I want to explain whenever we are doing the having clause. So first is not necessary to have that filled SQL expression in select list. Suppose currently I'm using all the this particular net price field is already in the which is having in select list, but it is not necessary what field I'm using here that that is available in select list or not available. It's not matter. Let me give one another example. I don't want to display based on this, but I want to display with the username suppose i want to i go to this data after get, getting this data i only want to display those means those sales order which is created by that particular user suppose i am using having uh, the er name there is something called in sales order table if you control space you will do control space er name equal to z above 3 we are using current global above 3 okay so like that i want to use but you can see i am getting one error here the erm is not specified in the group by expression we have to make sure it is it okay to not to have in select list but it should have in group by close because we have to group by that particular username also whenever i am grouping by the customer and uh, uh, the customer and customer name and currency i have to group by that particular username as well then only i can uh, use the having clause after that otherwise how i can use because that should be group that, uh, that should be grouped together that particular for, for particular user then only i can use for, uh, then then only i can put any condition on that particular group so i have to use this one in my group by clause that's a part that's i'm sure as I told you in my previous video, this sequence not matter. I can put here, here, anywhere. In group by close, the field sequence is not matter. So I go it like this. Now I ever go to remote. The point is first point. What was my first point? Not necessary to use this one in the select list. It's not necessary. We just want to filter out. We filter out and we want to display. Let me execute again. Control F3. And let me do F9. So you can see. I go, with the this user ID only two customers are there which which displayed here you can see only two customers are there and out of two customer we have one is having one sales order one is having eight sales order like that you can see the data this is I just this for the explaining how we can use what is but it should have in group by close that I, I told you it should be having in group by close not necessary to have in the field list but it should be available in group by close no need to specify aggregate function in group by third point I want to explain no need to specify the aggregate function in the group by what I mean this by uh, one second what I mean I this particular particular the whatever the field I am using uh, from the group by suppose control shift less than let me go one step back this is the same thing what what we have done and control shift greater than let me remove this one is not required now what it want to tell if i am using aggregate function in this having close that no need to specify in the group by close next thing all expression can be specified left hand side means as expression means SQL expression. So wherever, whenever I am using the having some all kind of expression I can specify here. I, uh, all kind of SQL expression or as you can see what all are the kind of SQL expression as I already explained in my all the videos throughout the uh, series like the we can use the con, uh, arithmetical expression we can use the string expression we can use the call as function and different different sale floor those all kind of expression we can use in the left hand side but last but most important field uh, important thing the right hand side we can use only the aggregate functions we can't use all the expression over here that's a very important thing whenever we are using having close so this is the basic I want to explain how we can use the having close how we can use having close whenever we are using the group by we want to filter out further data based on some condition whatever we got the result we can do using the having close.
this video is big enough i think so so in this video we have learned about having close in next video we will learn learn about union with different different examples before going to that video please like this video subscribe this channel and share these videos with others as well for next video i think link is there in your screen thank you and happy learning